Hi, it's Paris from Epic Reviews, a tech channel, and I wanted to talk to you about uh, one piece of software. If I could only pick one to take with me to go out on computer service calls, it would be this one. It's Malwarebytes, and I happen to have it on a, a disc here from buying it and having them send it to me when it was on special, but you don't need to get it this way. I would say most people just go to their website and download it um, online. There's a free version and a pay version. The free version you get online, the pay version comes on the disc and it's about $25 to buy it. And that's for a, a lifetime license. It doesn't expire in a year. The reason this is so good, this has uh, helped me fix many computer problems um, here in my family and I've bought it for people to fix uh, issues that they've had and it, it really works well. It, it's sort of a, a second set of eyes that you have on your computer to watch for infection. And uh, if it finds infection, it's very good at cleaning it up, whether it's in the registry, whether it's in the temporary files, whether it's replaced one of your Windows system files, and that's where the infection is. This is your best chance of fixing it is uh, this software right here. <clears throat> um, used it recently to fix, uh, fix it for someone who had that, that fake FBI infection where you just go to a website and the next thing you know, all of a sudden your computer screen is saying that you've been looking at illegal content online and the FBI is coming to seize your computer. But if you send them $200 via this uh, green dot online payment thing, well then that'll take care of the fine and you can have your computer back and the FBI won't come. Well, of course it's all a scam. But you can't do anything else on your computer. It locks the whole thing up. Now even if you have malware bytes, and if it gets past it, then you're, you're still going to have a hard time. But Again, it depends on exactly how far it's gotten on your computer and what it's done. In some cases, I've been able to get into safe mode and uh, update malware bytes, run malware bytes, it cleans it up. In others, it's been a little more extreme. You have to use some other software tools to kill off the infection that's uh, running in memory, and then you can get to malware bytes, and then it'll go in and find the pieces of the infection and clean it off the computer. Anyway, it's, it's helped with uh, lots of different infections, large and small. The free version, again, you can get from malwarebytes.org. Uh, you have to be very careful. There are a lot of companies that, because this is so good and so popular, a lot of companies have named their products, whether <coughs> legitimate or mostly ripoff, to sound just like it. So they confuse you into going and uh, getting their product, which you may actually be infecting yourself by doing. So you have to be real careful. Um, I'll put a link down below to go to Malwarebytes and the, the free version is good for cleaning up your computer once you're infected. The pay version, it basically runs in the background all the time. It will actually keep you from getting infected by a, quite a few things that would infect your computer. Um, you'll actually, <coughs> once you have the pay version running, you have a little icon down in the bottom right by the time and you'll get an occasional pop-up telling you it's blocked <coughs> either an outgoing process from the computer or something incoming. Uh, basically things coming and going that you wouldn't want to have coming and going. And so if you are a heavy internet user and you're doing research or things where you end up on a lot of websites that instead of the regular yahoo.com and uh, nbc.news.com, instead of the same websites you actually have a wider range of websites and you sometimes go places, neighborhoods on the internet, you don't know if they're good neighborhoods or bad neighborhoods, then this is a great tool to help keep you out of trouble. It's a small download um, if, you, if you buy it online and download it and it installs very quickly. If you have the paid version again, it, it checks for updates daily, it updates itself um, and it, it's running in the background and anytime you like you can tell it to do a full scan or a quick scan. And it won't replace your antivirus, you still need to have something. I happen to recommend Microsoft Security Essentials which is free from Microsoft. Um, but whichever you have, you know, whether you have a, the Norton or McAfee and they come with uh, anti-malware, anti-spyware add-ons, nothing's going to beat this one. Um, so you need a, a real antivirus to do the antivirus work and you need this to basically catch all the other stuff that may not be a true virus but will infect your computer, make it run slowly make uh, websites not load properly, redirect you to websites that you don't really want to go to, um, this is the one to get. So uh, search it out online, but make sure you get to the actual malwarebytes.org website to download it. Now, if you're trying out the free version, they may redirect you to another uh, site. They have partner sites. Because so many people download it daily, it's a cost to them to have to provide all of that. And so they have other uh, companies 
that uh, share the load and will help to distribute it. So if you get redirected to a site that um, you didn't expect, once you've been to the malwarebytes.org, it may send you to CNET or uh, you know, there are a number of other, probably five or six main sites. Don't panic, so long as it's uh, the Malware Bytes program and it's spelled correctly and you started out the malwarebytes.org website, you're, you're on the way to, to getting the right version. The, the pay version, you um, can download that or you get an email and there's a link in there that will download it directly so you don't have to worry about going to the wrong spot. Anyway, check it out for sure. This is good to have on your computer whether you've been infected or whether you haven't been infected yet.